So if you've seen my videos, you know I like throwing topwater lures, but my dad loves to throw them even more and he will not take off his topwater for anything. And something we do a lot is we go wade fishing and we always start with topwaters of course, uh, but at some point, say 10.30 or 11 in the morning, you start to notice that topwater bite slows down. And that's when I try to start throwing different things like soft plastics or what have you. But he stays resilient and he will keep throwing that top water. And lots of times uh, he will catch the biggest fish of the day just by keep using that, throwing it to potholes. Uh, sometimes those big fish just like to hunker down in those potholes and you can still catch them later in the day. And something that also happens is uh, fish schools will not move onto flats until later in the day and sometimes they are coming there to feed. So sometimes you can get a totally new topwater bite and get some crazy action at 12 in the afternoon. Um, so that's kind of what happened today. Doesn't feel like a lady, dude. Yeah, it's another trout, dude. Heck yeah. Another pretty nice sized one too. Oh yeah. Get on here. Top water, man, late in the day. Who'd have thought? Jesus! Uh, how big are you? That was about a 16, 17. <laughs> wow, threw on the top water. We got something. Got a crazy hit. I don't know what it is. Uh, it's a trout. It's a big trout, dude. It's pulling drag. Oh, dude, he's playing like a redfish. Look at this big trout. Oh my gosh, dude. This is the whole reason we came for a big trout and we got one finally. Oh yeah, dude. Top water, dude. It's gotta be, it's gotta be 1130. Let's just make sure to land this bad boy. Wow. Whoa, oh, one hook. Stay on there, buddy. Stay on there. Stay on there. Oh yeah. Big trout. Look at that big, big boy. Top water, dude, at 1130. Nice. All right, let's measure this dude. How big are you, dude? How big are you? Right about 20, dude. Exactly what I was hoping for. Nice 20 inch fish. Late in the day, look at that big mouth. See the little girl. Nice. There's another one, dude. Another trout, man. Wow, this is awesome, man. He <laughs> hooked in the tail. Look at this little guy. So the same lures will work in the afternoon that will work in the morning. Um, just your basic spooks and she dogs and top dogs will work um, of course bone is always a good color but something i like to throw a lot uh, later in the day is a chrome color and the chrome is nice because the fish can't really get a good bead on it they can't really tell what it is tell what the size is so it gives you that advantage when um, there's more light out another color you can also throw is a completely clear color they make spooks that are completely clear and those also do the same thing. The fish can't get a really good beat on it. So they can't get a good look at it even though the sun is out all the way. And of course, if the bite is tough, you can always use the tactic of downsizing your lures to a smaller lure uh, to coax out more bites. Got another trout on, dude. Another decent one. Whoa! And he gone. <laughs> dude, I'm catching so many trout right now. It's so late in the day, too. It's crazy on top water.